class. Today, for our A-Day grammar lesson, we are doing an activity with adjectives and adverbs. We have done a lot with adjectives and adverbs this year, but we're just going to be doing a lot of review activities in the next four weeks, our last four weeks of school. So today, since it's A-Day, I thought it would be a good day to go over adjectives and adverbs. You should have already listened to the story about adjectives. Remember, adjectives are words that describe nouns. Adverbs are words that describe verbs. Adjectives can be changed into adverbs when a sentence is rewritten so that the verb is being described instead of the noun. In the story about adjectives, we knew that and learned that with adjectives, they can give you more information about a noun. Remember, nouns are either people, places, or things. Let's look at that first example right there. It says, the happy teacher decorated the classroom. In that sentence, the word happy is used as an adjective because it is describing the noun, which is the teacher. Instead of just saying the teacher decorated the classroom, we use the adjective happy to say the happy teacher decorated the classroom. Well, in the next sentence, the word happy is now going to be used as an adjective. It says, the teacher happily decorated the classroom. Do you see how it is used differently? In that sentence, the word happy was used as an adverb. Remember, adverbs are words that describe the verbs. So, if you look at that, the verb in that second sentence is decorated, and we used happily to describe what the teacher was doing, which was decorating her room. The teacher happily decorated the classroom. So, in this sentence, the word happy was used as an adjective to describe the noun, which was teacher. And in the second one, happily was the adverb to, dis to describe the verb decorated. So what are you going to be doing with this activity? There's not a lot, but just enough that I can see if you understand it. So you are going to rewrite each sentence below changing each of the adjectives into an adverb. Remember, use those two sentences up, up above about the teacher and her classroom as an example. Let's look at this first one. The hungry dog ate a bone. So we can see the noun is dog and the word Hungry is the adjective to describe the dog. How can we use now the word hungry and change that word into an adverb that would describe the verb? Can you see what the verb is? The hungry dog ate a bone. So the verb is eight. So do your very best and then you can draw a picture of that sentence. The second one you are going to change, the lazy cat rolled over. Remember the word, the adjective in that sentence is lazy and then you're going to change that word into an adverb. And of course we can see that the verb is rolled. And in the last one, it says the loud bird is chirping. So we know bird is the noun. The adjective loud is describing the bird. 